Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I saw some, you know, stories today about people being mad about right clickers. And what are right clickers? Right clickers are people who right click and save NFTs. Now, here's the thing. People are Here's my here's the thing. NFTs are important and they are a great step in intellectual property rights in in the sense of they allow people to show ownership of so, of, of of something on the internet of a digital product without elaborate contracts or anything of the sort. You can walk into court and say I bought this at this time and this date. Here is proof of ownership. And and it is yours. This is the great thing about blockchain technology and NFTs. But the big but what people people are misunderstanding the importance of this here. When you buy an NFT, an NFT for millions of dollars even. You own that. You own the original copy of that and what you all and and what has not been fleshed out yet is the law around nfts or even like the common practices when i i have a current nft project of my own in the works that i'm going to be publishing on open sea in the near future and the fact of the matter is excuse me early the fact of the matter is is when i publish it do you know how what i'm going to say the owner of this nft has has the has commercial and and publishing rights to, to be, basically you can offer some level of rights to the person who owns it they can sell it and do whatever well, on the blockchain whatever but they can also sell use of it and anyone who and anyone who doesn't have ownership of that blockchain um, is not able to profit off of that. Now, I can certainly, as the blockchain owner, retain the right to retain those same rights for myself. But you know, some people may or may not do that. The point, pack fact of the matter is, is that blockchain technology is a, allows artists to much more easily contractually you know sell their art you know and yeah people will you know take it and do all that but the thing is is that people have copies of starry night or the mona lisa sitting in their house they're not the originals the originals are sitting up in galleries and they're very expensive and priceless it's kind of the same thing people can right click your nfts and there's nothing you can do to stop it but that but it doesn't necessarily devalue your investment whatsoever why well it's because you own the original copy you have ownership of the original copy when you own the original copy you can do things with that legally that you can't do with a copy you know if you wanted to you could go after somebody who is who had like published it on a you know, blog or even you can do a DMCA takedown on somebody's Facebook page for for having it. Like if that's something that you care about, you have ownership of it, and and, and it isn't until and we need to have some court cases and things like that flushed out before it's you know fully realized. But the fact of the matter is that unequivocally, NFT technology, block blockchain technology, is for the first time ever allows digital creations to have real world legit ownership all on the internet that can be rel- that can be pro- that could be protected by copyright law and this is so huge for artists my girlfriend i've told her that when she gets when i see her in a couple weeks in, uh, next week i'm t- i told her that if you are going to sell your photos you need to you mint to mint them as nfts and then you can sell the commercial rights and all that of ownership of having ownership of that blockchain it's brilliant when you think about it but either way 
we'll get there eventually. A bunch of crybabies are talking about right left clickers and all that bullshit. It doesn't matter. The fact of the matter is, is that if you own an NFT, you own it, and you in 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 over time, the laws are going to come forward and prove that. Either way, that's just all I wanted to say. NFTs are functionally just the future of out of sort of like ownership of things online. And that's important because as we start to live in a more and more online world and a concept like ready play like the world of ready player one becomes is, is starting to look like it's going to be more of a reality than anything. Well, needless to say, it's going to be interesting. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for listening. Appreciate you and, I, and yes, I am minting those nfts in the near future as we speak keep an eye out and i look forward to releasing them ladies and gentlemen have a lovely rest of your day and i'll see you guys next time